generation of computer after we will discuss about characteristics of computer and then after we will discuss about some it pioneers who have given pan data computer and lots of types of application software Computer in the form of desktop computer, laptop computer, and tablets have become such an important part of our life that it is difficult to remember a time when they did not exist. With the passing of time, like a like a baby, when he grows and become older than older, that become a man. Just like that, in computer. There are so many changes. Continuous. Lots of people has given part in it, and they become such types of computer like in today's time we are using. What computer we are using? That all are small in size, and they have a micro chip. In the previous time, there are so many computer. Which have covered a cross of all area, and after that, some people, some scientists, or some conventional, uh, some pioneers has discovered a computer which cover a cross one two areas. After that, uh, computer size become so smaller, and these computer are example best example. a computer which are desktop computer laptop computer and phone computer and in today's time we are using a smartphone that is also like a computer which can also pro uh, which we can also do all types of computerized work let learn about history of computer first of all we will discuss about abacus we all have seen that abacus is look like this That has the B or star. It is a bell. It looks like a bell. In which rows are in the vertical order. Rows are there in the vertical order. It looks like this. Uh, the word abacus is right from the B word abacus. 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 Um, a battery calculating board or calculating table. In the earlier time, man used his fingers and toes to count things for quantities greater than ten. Because we all have ten fingers, and in the in our toes or ten, there are ten fingers. So that natural item, we all are using natural item also like papers, cheeses, twigs, abacus, twigs. Abacus is used to counting and calculating. So abacus we can count and calculate the things and a number. It consists of beads or twigs that can be moved up and down. We can move the beads. Up and down, and we can count any kind of things. After that, we will discuss about Napier's ball. See, Napier's ball. Why this gadget called Napier ball? Because Napier ball has invented to this 
computer that is why it called as napier's box now let's discuss about pascal's fastly pascal's fastly is a type of computer or a device it mechanical pascal pascal has developed this device that is why he gave it the his name to this device pascal belong from france he is a french french scientist uh, he uh, developed this device invented this device device in 1642 but this device could only do subtraction and addition that is why some scientists were not satisfied by this invention and they do work on it continuously now we will discuss on different engine different engine was uh, designed by charles babbage in 1822 he discussed uh, he invented uh, different engine for only calculation it is a calculation machine that is why it is called also a calculation machine which are used Uh, arithmetic uh, addition. After that, Charles Babbage also invented analytical engine. Analytical engine was general purpose automatic mechanical digital computer. Uh, in an uh, analytical engine, they have a they had a, a punch card. He uh, he. attached a punch card in it uh, this device was uh, work on punch card and uh, it had the storage capacity also uh, it work on input and output after then we will discuss on tabulating machine tabulating machine is a uh, tabulating machine were invented by the herbert uh, herman alfred in 18 90 it was invented to help process data for the us congress it is a world first calculating machine after that we will discuss on generation of computer see what is the generation of computer like in our house uh, there are so many people live together like our grandparents our parents and their child like that way in computer there are so many generations five generation are there so in that there are so many computer has that let's learn about generation vision in the first generation in windows use back to two and that uh, first generation computer were very big in size and they are very costly also um, they um, first generation computer cover the space uh, space across one room very slow first generation computer were work very slow and generate heat also when they start to work Lots of new thing coming from inside, and example for India and Uniper. Let's learn. Uh, let's see about second generation. Second generation computer. In second generation computer, inventor use uh, transistor, and they were little bit of smaller than first generation computer. and they were less costly uh, compared to first generation computer and faster than first and they were very faster than first generation computer they were more reliable also because they does they were accurately and the examples of first second generation computer were i think that and Uh, Atlas and Mark third. After that, let's come to the third generation computer. Third generation computer 
rooms in the graded circuit are checked. That is called as ICO zone, which we are using in our mobile also in today's time. And even so, in the smaller third generation computer world, so smaller compared to the first and second generation computer, they were so much cheap also, they were less costly compared to these computer, generation computer and much faster they were. Much faster than this computer. Efficiently used monitor and keyboard. And the features were efficiently used monitor and keyboard. We were, people were used monitor and keyboard in this generation. And the example was IBM 367 are the example of third generation computer. Let's move on to fourth generation computer. Fourth generation computer. Uh, the developer used a microprocessor. Microprocessor is also called a microchip. Uh, they were very small in size and cost, but too much degree. They were not so much costly and they were very fast. Uh, it was very efficient to use of mouse and GUI based use in these computer. Uh, inventors use the we were people for use the uh, mouse in GUI based OS. GUI based OS means graphical user interface operating system. Which uh, which computer we are using in today's life are called a GUI based operating system. Uh, some examples of GUI based operating systems are like uh, desktop computer, laptop computer, and palm card computer. After that, some examples of fourth generation computer are IBM PCs, DC, PAN. Let's move for the fifth generation computer. Fifth generation computer have a artificial intelligence. And uh, these computers are very small in size and cost maybe Decrease cost, they are not so much high cost, they are so cheaper than these types of generation computer and very high speed. Fifth generation computer were very high speed. And voice recognition in these computers, there is a facility to recognize the voice of any speakers. Reliability. Reliability means the wishes. 
Thank you. Have a nice day.